Three weeks until Election Day, all eyes were on Florida last night as the two candidates vying for one of Florida's U.S. Senate seats went head to head in their only debate before Election Day. And things got contentious. Aaron Parsegian joining us live this morning with a recap and three takeaways. There was no shortage of fireworks, Frank and Caitlin. Incumbent Republican Senator Marco Rubio and Democratic challenger Congresswoman Val Demings traded blows right away in the fast-paced hour-long debate as the two argued their stance on abortion, what's become one of the defining issues heading into the midterm after SCOTUS overturned Roe v. Wade. I'm 100% pro-life, because I, not because I want to deny anyone their rights, but because I believe that innocent human life is worthy of the protection of our laws. That said, Every bill I've ever sponsored on abortion, every bill I've ever voted for, has exceptions. Every one of them does, because that's what can pass, and that's what the majority of people support. Now, what was before us today in Congress that you talk about Lindsey Graham's bill, that's a four-month ban. How gullible do you really think Florida voters are? Number one, you have been clear that you s support no exceptions, even including rape and incest. As a senator, I think those decisions are made between the woman, her family, her daughter, and her faith. The temperature stayed high as the debate moved to the topic of guns in America. It, denying point. the right to buy it is not going to keep them from doing it. Here's the fundamental issue. The fundamental issue is why are these kids, why are these people going out there right, and sir, massacring this is, people? This is the same, a lot of people this is own AR-15s and they don't made. kill everyone. I understand, sir, but I want to go to Congress. It has nothing to do with the Second Amendment. This is about taking dangerous guns out of the hands of dangerous people. And the overwhelming majority of people in our nation want us to do just that. Whether it was abortion, guns, inflation, neither candidate really strayed from where their party stands on those issues. But they did take time to criticize each other's records. Of course, the senator who has never run anything at all but his mouth would know nothing about helping people and being there for people when they are in trouble. The congresswoman likes to talk about helping people. She's never passed a bill. She's never passed a single bill. She's been in Congress for over half a decade. She's never passed a bill, not PPP, not anything. Not a single bill she's passed has ever become law. With just three weeks until the election, will this debate sway any voters? That remains to be seen. Val Demings has been winning the fundraising race, but Senator Rubio has held a consistent lead in the polls thus far. We'll have more reaction to the debate later on this morning on Brightside. Live in studio, Aaron Parsegian, 10 Tampa Bay.